James still grew up in a small town in Kansas, IRT's playwright in residence, finds himself writing a play set in the Middle East about a CIA agent. Not what I expected. Miranda is the third play, the final play in a trilogy uh, about a family. The trilogy started with the house that Jack built that the IRT did the world premiere of in 2012. Next season, we will be doing the second play in the trilogy and the second production of that play, and that's called Appoggiatura. And the third play is Miranda. Each play is standalone. An audience can come to any play in any order and have a complete experience with that play. IRT audiences will have had the chance to see all three plays. It's the only theater in the country so far that will have done all three plays. Honestly, when I started writing The House That Jack Built, I had no idea I was writing a trilogy. Uh, I found myself in the middle of writing each play, realizing there was so much more that I wanted to explore. And I think for me with Miranda, she came forward as a character. She's talked about as an offstage character in The House of Jack Built. So I knew she was in there and I knew there was a story. I wasn't sure what that story was, but once I committed to it, I really had to dig in. You can't fake a story about a CIA operative in the Middle East. I was able to locate a retired CIA operative, a woman who lives in Minneapolis. She had been in the CIA for 31 years, uh, and she agreed to meet with me. We first emailed, and I was asking her a lot about my ideas, and then she agreed to meet with me, and it all felt, you know, kind of wonderfully covert that I was going to meet with a CIA agent. And the 30 minutes that she had promised me turned into about five hours of conversation. And I realized as I was talking to her, if I can capture the essence of what she's talking about in my play, then I think an audience is going to be as interested and fascinated as I am by this. Especially when you are a visitor as a writer to another culture, as I am in Miranda. How do you approach your citizenship in that play with a kind of integrity? I Skyped with a woman who is from Yemen, who is Yemeni, and really getting to talk to her about her country, about her culture, uh, about the political situation there. And that, again, was invaluable because it was so personal. You have to get some kind of, it's almost like spiritual permission to enter into that holy world of someone else's life. And in this case, that meant the CIA, that meant Yemen. It is about people, and I wanted to be sensitive. I wanted to be culturally sensitive. And so that required, again, reaching out to resource people, working out, uh, reaching out to Arabic speakers, uh, to Muslims, um, to CIA officers, uh, doing the homework, doing the work, uh, coming at it with integrity, and ultimately being proud to have by James Still, written under that title.